Tonight we're going to revisit municipal plants and uh, in the last time we met I had um, Naomi Leesk from Mount Lakatla come and share her knowledge as well but she's uh, busy with culture camp this week so she's resting up in the evening so if any of you have questions about any of these plants I definitely recommend reaching out to her. So here comes the pin for round one. Six, four, nine, four, eight, one, six. All right, is that everybody? Okay, let them see that number on one and we just put it. Powerful and dangerous plant can be used externally for sore joints. Keep on the stove to avoid further contingent. Bufenj is the triangle, Wolfsh is the diamond. Grows waist high and found on muskeg picking in the spring, summer, and fall. Used for, useful for coughs and sore throat. Steady in the triangle, blow them up to the diamond. Wood for smokehouses used as a dye and brew a drink helps. Stomach problems. Rui is the triangle. Dahakwaduk is the diamond. Godum Tibin, Sagwagaluk, and a three ancestry Amzabin. Grows in moss, moist rocks, and tree trunks. Medicine for coughs and whooping cough. So it um, is the triangle. Mazagale is the diamond. We're a little split on that one. That's okay. Gibu is so wagalak and a four and sister gam seven. Comes from the Shmagat word for bow, slowest growing trees in the world. The bark is used for a modern cancer drug. Shahoygan is the triangle. Shahoygan is the diamond. Shahoygan. Ibu Sawagalakana five and Sishri Gam seven. Roots are boiled like tea, used to help children with measles. Steady is the triangle. Shtaya is the diamond. Steady. Ibu Sawagalakana six and Sishri Gam seven. Harvest in spring and early summer uses a shampoo to prevent lice and dander. There's many illnesses. Wolfs is the triangle. Wolfs is the diamond. 
Oops. Here's our round one podium. Izzy got the bronze. Bottom Steven got the silver. Right. Yes, we'll plant uh, before we jump in there. If you want to give me a reaction, if you want to practice saying the vocab and phrases out loud a heart or a thumb. We have food coming in a little bit, so I'm going to hold off so the food gets here. So no we're not interrupted. No problem. I do have an Amazon Fresh delivery ah! coming too, and I have to give them my ID because I got some alcohol this time. <laughs> so I'll leave for a little bit. Sorry. That's okay. How about we go Dim Shilhite Ebao, Don Hezi, and Godum Tevin when you're when you're ready. All right, yes, we'll plant. So this is just a disclaimer, just because I'm teaching it, I don't want you guys to just start going out and gathering it. Um, please make sure an elder or an expert um, that's gathered plants before is with you as you're learning. Um, I just put this out to cover my own butt because <laughs> I don't want folks to just, um, just because you learn from me means it's okay for you to, Go out and start gathering right now. Um, I added this when I got requested to do this presentation for the Alaska Native Medical Center uh, here in Anchorage. So this is just to cover me. All right, Ushend is our first municipal plant. Gothwil Aitka Ushend Kompshimano. I've only ever been told a poison root. Oh, we hoik. Am's oven. So Hushenj is powerful and a dangerous plant that should only be used by those with complete understanding of its properties. It's used for purification uh, externally for sore joints. And when there's a sickness in the house, uh, Hushenj can be kept or near a stove in the kitchen to help avoid further contingent. And I think some people were um, finding it helpful when COVID first started in 2020, because some elders had mentioned gathering it specifically for that. Our practice phrase is poison root is really good for you. Up look well, how am who duck one? Am seven. Up look well, how am who duck one? Am seven. Up look well, how am who duck one? Am seven. I can go. It's not here yet. Okay. How am the sense the one? And seven. Gulamaksh. Gosh, will I try Gulamaksh? Come to you, Emma.
Hudson Bay team? We hoiks. Yeah. I asked my son. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, you know, cool. down down here they call it Labrador tea, and I didn't know it was the same thing until very recently. Oh, <laughs> Labrador tea, Liggy, Hudson Bay tea. Um, I used to know it in Yukdun too. Depends on who's who you're harvesting with. <laughs> uh, Gorilla Mux is an evergreen plant that grows waist high and found on the muskeg. Has narrow dark green leaves lined underneath with uh, rust colored woolly hairs. They're found across northern Canada and southeast Alaska, uh, up here around New York as well. It's picked in the spring, summer, and fall. Tea can be made with fresh leaves or can be dried. When dried, they turn brown. You store them in a cool place for winter, Hudson Bay tea used for a beverage and medicine, useful for coughs, colds, and sore throats. Our phrase is dim gultum gwilamuk zitla hatli squiped. We'll pick tea on Sunday. Dim gultum gwilamuk zitla hatli squiped. Am seven. Dim Gultum Quillamox Zithla Hatley Squite. Am seven. Dim Gul Gulletim Quat Willa Mach Silla Hats Kli Quacked. Dim Gultum. Willa Max Disla Hatley Schweikers. Can't say that one. Hatley. Hatley Schweikers. Am seven. Does anyone know the breakdown of Willa Max? Devin learned in Raven Wright's camp. <laughs> Y'all. So Gwilla is always and Maksh is grow because it grows um, all year round. So always grows Gwilla Maksh. Louis. Gothwal Aitka Luia Gumshimamuk. Is it Alder? We hoik and seven. And there's different ways of spelling it. Louis, Louis, Louis. Uh, provides important wood for fuel in smokehouses because it doesn't have much pitch chopped into small pieces and soaked in water to brew a drink used for stomach problems and sore eyes. It can be used um, fresh or the inner bark can be dried. Used as a dye that produces colors ranging from almost black to dark brown to bright orange red. The things that were dyed um, were bark, cedar bark, fishing nets and lines, wood, mountain goat wool and hair. Uh, it was also used for our tattooing, and I misspelled tattooing. Our phrase is Lu launched um, Masha Shimgan that's in Aksha Louis Dim Dip will she mask it. We soak the bark in alder to make it red. Amsaben. <laughs> Blue 
Luke. Lulut. Sim. Masa sedang dah. Sim. Akta lui. Dim. Bip. Will see Mexican. Yeah, I'm done. Lulut. Kem. Mas. Masa simkan da dim aksha lui dim dip well see mas am dubbin to it ga um go full eight ga to it ga um uh gumshi ramok Is that friend? A friend? You I'm Fern. We grish root. We hoiks. So to it ka um liggy to uga um uh is licorice root. So the small fern with long roots that grow in the moss and on moist rocks and tree trunks. The root tastes like licorice. Used for coughs and whooping cough. Harvested early spring until late fall by pulling the fern out of the ground with its roots prepared by pounding roots and boiled in water, then stored in a cool place. Our phrase is um up dempt dawalat hoba na akshit wak ult da kshak upt. The gwish root just boil it, then drink the juice and sometimes eat it raw. Um up dempt dawala hoba na akshit wak ult da kshak up. And seven. Sick a am up dumped double at hoba na axit wa cook the ksha gapt. And seven. Xa am up dumped double at hoba na axit wa cook the gapt. Am seven. Zim tick am am app zim da will it poopa na ask it wa coat da gasa gut. Am seven. Shahakodak go full eitka shahakodak gumshimamuk. You tree. We hoiks. So before Western science learned of the cancer healing properties of the yew tree or yew wood, First Nations people have made medicine from this small but strong evergreen. It's one of the slowest growing trees in the world. The wood is valuable and often traded with interior people where it doesn't grow. Shahakwaduk comes from the word for bow. Compound found in yew bark, which is used in some modern cancer drugs, is called tachol, after the Latin name tachus, meaning bow as well. Shahakwaduk, you would. Our phrase is ama khadaukha shahakwaduk, you would makes good medicine. Ama Haldauka Sahakwadak. Hands of an Ama Haldauka Sahakwadak. Hands of an Ama Haldauka Sahakwadak. Hands of an
steady gospel at the steady comes to me. This is Nedo, singing Nedo. We hoiks. A steady is used for the used in the world around the world as a fiber or as a tea. First Nation people use it. Uh, the young shorts as a vegetable and it tastes similar to spinach. Uh, nettle stems can be processed to yield a very strong fiber used for centuries to make rope clothing and fishing nets. The roots used uh, are used to make medicine boiled until it looks like tea. It's helped children in the past with measles and uh, the leaves are used for tea as well. Steady. Our phrase is Kotsa steady, the flakshianst adat hadik belt. Cut the nettles after the leaves are off, uh, split them. Kotsa steady, the flakshianst adat hadik belt. M7. Oh, steady. The slut's and that I think about. And seven. Oh, steady. The slut's yens and that had the bark. And seven. Oh, steady. The slut. Kiss it, yens, yens, add it, add it, about. Womps, go well, I think a womps, a gumps, you am a devil's club. We hoiks. Uh, womps is our most important plant uh, of the coast. It's used not only for medicine, but for ceremonial and supernatural uses. Teas made from mulch are very potent and should be treated with respect. Low sprawling shrub with prickly spines on the vines of the broad leaves and along the greenish brown woody stems. They're found in the woods, uh, often along uh, stream banks. They're a member of the ginseng family uh, Simshin harvests them in the spring and early summer, used as a hair shampoo to prevent lice and dandruff, and also works for cradle cap when babies have cradle cap. Wompsh. Our phrase is look well and wompsh on a guts eight. Devil's club is good for his arthritis. Lupo am warmth and a and seven. Lupo am warmth and a that's it. Am seven. Lupo am warmth and a up, get. Am seven. Hash, go full, I got hash, a gumshoe and milk. Fireweeds. We hoiks. And it's also a uh, liggy uh, dogs. Uh, hash is used for migraine, common cold, stomach ulcers, uh, enlarged prostate. Uh, it's a wound healing and reduces swelling and inflammation. It's got vitamin C and A in it. The shoots and young leaves can be eaten raw in salads, sautéed or steamed like you would asparagus. And I really want to learn how to gather them and make jelly. Ash jelly is my favorite. 
My mom's getting some for her backyard, um, but I like to have it for tea. Mm. It helps my achy joint. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, you just dry the leaves and brew tea. The uh, restaurant that catered my work luncheon at the end of the school year had fireweed tea for us. It was really yummy. Our phrase for hash is hoy get a hash da hell ashed. People use fireweed to whip soap berries. Hoy get a hash da hell ashed. And Devin. Hoy get a hash da hell ashed. And Devin. Hoy get a hash. The help us. And seven. Boy, get a hash to help us. And seven. This uh, last one I threw in because there's a lot of it um, here in New York. Uh, help. Go to Aitka, help. Uh, we hoiks. Um, the Denina people here in Anchorage, they use birch for everything for their boats and their baskets and uh, I had just learned this um, with their sap that it promotes good digestion and reduces bloating. Uh, it helps strengthen the immune system, has anti-cancer properties, and aids weight loss. Can support keeping cholesterol levels under control and use. And we used it for chopping seaweed because the wood doesn't split. So this is a new thing that I had learned about how. Birch. And our phrase is how hoy get da hatli yet plucks. I forgot the bardell there, sorry. People use birch tree for chopping seaweed. How hoy get da hatli yet plucks. And seven. How Hoy yet the hat yet la us. And seven. Ha 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 hoy get the hat yet la la. And seven. Ha hoy get the hat yet la us. I was watching videos of people using birch to make baskets and uh, because I have two birch trees in our new house and I was like what can I do with these <laughs> so now I know even more I'm like gonna be like how do I get sad out of it I, I'll have to find an elder to teach me uh, yeah, there, there was an elder teaching a class at the Heritage Center this summer they're trying to think of activities for the community to do outside during the summertime I forget how much it cost for the class, but all the materials were, were provided because one of the gals in our dance group took it. Oh, that sounds awesome. Before we play round two, I'm going to take a quick pussy. Everyone can turn on their cameras. <laughs> all right, cool, cool, holy. Cool. And stuff shown. Stretch your mosh for round two. All right, nine, five, two, six, four, five, seven.
Is it pronounced Bugatti? Yes, it's a very fancy car. That's okay. Mahir's choice. Just want to make sure. All right, bottom to dot number round two. Hash. Learn to be tricky. You guys caught it. Gotta remember I'm done how to Louie. Louie, Alder. Bushenge. Poison root, Hussend, Gordon Tibin, Sabaga Luck on a three and this Jake Gam Seven. Wonks. Wonks, Devil's Club. Don, Sabaga Luck on a four and this Jake Gam Seven. Gulamaks. Lumux, Hudson AT, Liggy, Labrador T, Bugatti, Sogwalak on a five answer streak. Steady. Don, Sogwalak on a six answer streak, Am Zubin. To Ika Am. Fish root. Don Sagwaga Luck and a seven answer shake and seven. Shahakwaduk. You would. Don Sagwaga Luck and a eight answer shake and seven. Hulk. And Zepsham. Here's our round two podium. Bugatti got the bronze. <clears throat> Don got the silver. What is it? And bottom two got the gold. Yay! Yeah, I'm so sad. Dykes and Tita. Oh, Dykes. It's been a it's been a busy summer. I miss you. I'm looking forward to the <laughs> when it's not so busy. Oh, <laughs> we almost went to the pool today. It's so hot, but I was like, oh wait, Amazon order and Schmaliak. So just <laughs> the big kids went. Huh? Yeah, it's really hot. We went to our friend's pool. I'm still wearing my wet swimsuit because it's helping me stay cold. <laughs> Very hot. But glad it'll be better next weekend. Yeah. Yeah. Bless you. Bless you. <laughs> well, Lou, I'm going to need to some. I'm going to go. Google. Google. Google.